let's uh, use this file okay so it is in target okay so now let's import uh, the metadata now let's import the metadata for a sequential file so go to target this is the one call this one first line consider the header okay so double quotes done sequential file Null of field, if there are any null values, just give a single space. Next to enter button. Okay. So now go to columns. So we don't know the metadata, right? So we can make automation. Okay. So click on load here. Go to so file sequence. But this folder is not the target folder. The file it is located in this folder actually. It is not there. Okay. So what you can do is right click import sequential file definition. So ours is a comma separated file. Okay, so if you want to see all the files, you can see all the files. Go to that directory. This is the one. Okay, so emp dot, this is the one. So first line we have header, right? Consider first line with header. So since it's a comma separated file, we can uh, click on this comma separated file. Okay. Okay. So now we can see the data here. Okay. So define the actual length as per the profile length. So here four. Sorry. Four, six, nine, four, ten, four, four. So profile length. So actually, display length is nothing but uh, it's it will scan entire data in the file. That will be the profile length. Okay. So click on OK. Okay, so here, click on close. Now it, it, it will be reflected here. So here we forgot to consider that uh, adding the nullability, nullability setting nullability to yes. Okay, so what we can do now, you can go to table definition here in the repository. So double click on this, go to columns, set to nullability to yes. Okay. So this way also we can, yeah, now click on okay. Now call this one here, oh. We have clicked on cancel, so that is the reason what and all changes we did, that and all path. I'll fill value, single space. Okay, so click on load. So we have already imported the table definition. Click on this. Okay. So again, click on OK. Now let's view the data.
Okay, so you can see here. We are able to view the data. Click on plus. Click on OK. Okay. So we have defined this sequential pipe, right? 